heading out to Boston, taking the ferry from Orient Point. Man, I've got about a week's worth of growth. If I'm not too exhausted when I get to my hotel tonight, I'm gonna be using a new razor, new disposable razor from the folks at Bevel. So I believe this is one of the first, if not the first, disposable single edge razor. And I just believe that, I don't, I have no clue. And I haven't done any research. But enjoy. Sitting with my buddy John. It looks like he needs a proper shave. If I give you a, a bevel disposable safety razor, will you shave? Yeah, so two for the price of one on this review, maybe. Okay guys, so I've just checked into the beautiful Hampton Inn and Suites in Boston, Waltham. Nice hotel, relatively new, some cool decor. There's like an old radio theme. And I'm about to tackle this beard. Now, as I said earlier, this beard's been on my face now for a little over a week. And this is the dilemma that I come to all the time when I have the beard growing. I kind of like it. And to have a channel where you do men shaving and then having a beard. So what I think I'm going to do for tonight, I think I'm going to do a little neck cleanup. And I'll flirt with the beard for a little bit longer. I've got my Knicks hat on. Very appropriate for being in Boston. Go Knicks. All right, and I'm gonna be showing you the perfect travel companion for some of you folks who are what I would call more of the pure shavers, shave snobs, if you will. Bevel has just released safety razors that are disposable. And this is an intriguing product. My buddy, shaverboy516 on Instagram, he kind of told me about these and said, you got to pick them up. I picked them up and we're going to shave with it tonight. I'm going to do a little neck cleanup. I was in Family Dollar and picked up this Power Stick Shave Foam Cooling Formula. It's not travel size, but for a dollar, I could just leave it here if I wanted to. I'm going to be using that today. So without further ado... Let's get right into the shave. What am I making you guys wait for? I'm gonna steam up with one of these beautiful, fresh washcloths and get cracking. Now I'm gonna steam up with near hot water. Near hot, not hot, near hot. Hot water, guys, can burn your sensitive, beautiful skin and you don't wanna do that. Not a lot of hot water in Waltham, Massachusetts, guys. All right, so I'm gonna steam up with some lukewarm water. Hopefully there's warm water in the shower in the morning. All right, let's take a look at this packaging here. It says disposable safety razor for coarse or curly hair. Bevel shaves at the skin level. It helps prevent razor bumps in grown hairs. So there's a little diagram there. And what you want to avoid if you have the propensity of ingrown hairs or irritation, razor bumps, you want to keep the hair, the cut, either just above the hair line or the skin line, right? Or just even with it. You never want to manipulate the skin so you're shaving that hair where it would be, you know, when the skin is back in place where it's lower than the skin line because if you have curly hair and your hair is going to curl and it's cut lower than the skin line slightly, it could curl back in under the skin and we know that's painful and unsightly. Don't want to do it. And Bevel is designed 
Their products are designed to put just enough gap to uh, sort of mitigate that. So here is a pack of five and it feels like plastic. It's got a cover here. I would assume that's a cover. And wow, this looks like a bevel razor. It's got that patented curve. It feels light but firm. Now let's read what, what this is made of. Made with 45% wheat straw. And it's disposable. I believe this pack of five cost me $6, maybe $7 at Target. I'll leave a link in the description box below if these are sold on Amazon and you can pick them up. All right. Helps prevent nicks, tugs, reduces irritation. It's a bevel razor and it has this little cover plate. So if you want to use this two or three times, have at it. All right, one more. Steam up with a very lukewarm water. And we'll take off the glasses and we'll get into the shave. All right, power stick shave gel cooling. Shaved foam, rather. Very springy foam. I'm just gonna do a nice cleanup. So this has a a barbershop smell to it right off the tip. And I feel a little cooling sensation, a little tingle. And that's nice. So we're just going to clean up for tomorrow's shoot. And we'll ponder the beard. You know, what's nice about this is if you're sort of on the fence as to whether to try the safety razor. A $7 investment for five might be the way to scratch that itch. All right, so I'm gonna leave the beard long if I decide to keep it. And I'm just leaving a little bit more hair under the jawline. Gives it a more natural look, guys. And provides a nice base. If you want to get one of those really beefy beards, you have a foundation now to let that beefy beard grow. This is a very mild blade, but very effective as you can tell. A week's worth of stubble, more than a week, and it's really having no problem. If this was a multi-blade cartridge razor, except for the stubble eraser, you'd really be struggling here, or I'd be struggling. So again, I'm leaving that long. Painted that long. And I'm really impressed with this. Feels good in the hand. It's stiff enough. It's got that patented bevel curvature. Let me get back in here and do another pass. Now, the lukewarm water is killing me a little bit. I'll be honest with you. So it's good I'm only doing a neck cleanup here. I'm gonna run this bevel disposable through its paces in a longer video, but let's get back into this. Let's do a cross grain and we'll do an against grain pass as well. A little bit more cooling foam. Again, I'm painting up to where I wanna keep that hair. 
and I'm letting the hair stay longer when you cut it right to the jaw. It just looks very unnatural. It looks like a chin strap. And you want, at least I want my beard to look organic. Natural. So now I'll just do a cross grain. Can you hear that feedback? It's good feedback, guys. But a very mild razor. Like it a lot. Oh, nice. Easy goes it. Very nice. Go back up to the neck. And we're going to do our last pass. Three passes. I'll do an against grain pass just to get right clean up. I didn't even go back to the can of foam, but I can. Just a little bit more foam. Again, I'm probably going to leave this here. I'm not wowed by power stick. Serviceable. But maybe not worth carrying him back home. Leave it for someone who might need it here. And we're gonna go with the third and final pass. And that's gonna be against the grain. Oh, nice and smooth, guys. Taking my time, approaching the hair at about a 30. 35 angle or degree approach. And again, taking my time and going right up to that line. And voila, we've got a beautiful, easy shave. What I'm going to do, I'm going to let this dry out on another fresh hand towel here at the Hampton Inn. So I'll let that dry out. And I'm going to call it a night. Call it a night, guys. But I like it. I like the bevel. Disposable double-edged razor, safety razor, very, very nice, guys. Really nice product. Great idea. Um, so the Bevel Disposable Safety Razor, Average Guy Tested, Average Guy Approved. I want to thank you guys for watching. Also, Hampton Inn & Suites in Boston, Waltham. Average Guy Tested, Average Guy Approved. And as always... You guys, thanks for watching. You are Average Guy approved as well. I'll see you next time, whenever that is. But in the meantime, you know what to do. Keep pushing play. Now roll the music.